afternoon, everybody. How's things? It uh, can't be as manic as it is here at the minute. We, um, we've finished packing parcels, which I think we're practically done, I think. Uh, we're prepping for the show on uh, or the show for the NEC, which we're going down to set up tomorrow. And we're doing lives and yeah, it's all go. We've got somebody in checking the printer for us and yeah, it's a bit crazy. But do you know what? We love it. We wouldn't want it any other way. We are super excited to be uh, actually coming out on the road and the NEC four days. So hopefully uh, you'll uh, you'll all be there or some of you will be there to come and see. Now I do want to say about the NEC, you must wear your badge if you've got one. If you have and you've got it on, we will give you a 10% discount on our stand. So please, please make sure you wear it, okay? It's no good saying you've got one at home. I'm just warning you now, because you know what John's like, it'll not happen. So absolutely. Okay, are we ready then? So here we go, tile 327. I'm using a light greyish type of tile, not too light, but uh, here we go. And I've kept it plain. I have got a finished sample and it's like Leslie in and out. Sorry. God, you can't you? Oh, goodness me. So yeah, um, I have got one here that I've inked so you can sort of be able to see the difference um, later on, but we'll, uh, we'll go for it, shall we? We'll uh, have, a, have a go. So here we go, next bit then. I'm gonna start, let's have a look. I'm gonna start with the border. So we're coming in, um, I'm just gonna use my tile because I do have a ruler, but it could be anywhere right now, <laughs> quite frankly. Um, yeah, we're all sort of like trying to shift around. We can only go one at a time down the corridor and <laughs> we have to shimmy through and all sorts. Uh, but yeah, it's all good fun. John's not had a strop yet though, so <laughs> anything could happen. It's fine. <laughs> all right, here we go then. So that's our first sort of little bit. Let's just sort of angle my camera so you can see it. A little bit of a border with a pencil. I'm going to continue that idea of uh, using a pencil because I want to sort of put myself a mark in the middle. There we go. So let's have a look. Ish. Nothing's ever measured exactly. You know that. There we go. In there. Okay. All right. So there's my little cross. And what I want to do is I'm just going to put myself a, a little line in. Again, this is just a guide. See, it's sort of, let's imagine the same sort of distance either side there. So there we go. Okay. And then I'm going to make myself like um, a line this way as well. See, just so it comes down, joins there. Yours doesn't have to be the same size. I've just got a guide there because I want to draw something in here. Okay, so don't want you to panic without it. It's not a problem at all. Okay. Well, I've got my cross, I'm just going to put a little mark at the bottom as well. All right, so far so good. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to stick with pencil and I want to put some little lines in now. So starting from my cross, I'm going to imagine where I'm getting to the point here, but I want to come round in a, a bit of a curve. Let's come down a little bit. So I'm going to create this kind of a shape, okay? So whether you want to do it this way or this way, so I'm going to try it this way. I usually bring it towards me, okay? But I want it to touch the sides like that, okay? And the same on this side. So you see where that curve's starting? Let's put a mark there. And the pencil's just gonna allow you to uh, sketch it in if you feel you need to. So you've got those shapes as similar as you can, okay? So if I turn it round, same sort of thing. There we go, into that one. Okay. And oh. Oh, Leslie's sorting out the uh, make and take bags. We do have um, an opportunity to do some make and takes. They're going to be, if you need, if you want to come and do it, they're uh, going to be five pound each but you need to book because there's only I think there's only 12 spaces on each day so um, that's something you need to come and see me with if that's what you want to do but uh, yeah so she's making the bags up I'm just saying that because if there's a pen missing it's not my fault <laughs> they say that's a little bit it's not quite the same but that's okay she's like she didn't hear that she'd gone in the other room 
and I'm going to draw that shape in. All right. All right. So again, you've got, you know, you've got the opportunity here that you can change that shape around a little bit if you need to. There we go. I'm following it. They don't have to be perfect. We know that, so don't panic if it isn't. Absolutely, Chris. Blame the elf. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to tell her that when she comes back. I don't know where she's gone. Disappeared in the midst behind platform nine and three quarters. There we are. <laughs> okay, and around. Creating that little shape there. Okay, two little hearts. <laughs> oh, Ari, you'll tell her, will you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to do an aura now on the inside. Come on, focus, focus. So around we go. In. So I'm saying this way now again, whatever works for you, whether it's that way first or that way. If you feel you need to, you can stop part way. And along. Around we go. And along. Hi Jules, how's Caitlin and Maddie? You're okay. They're liking their new pencils. So, yeah. A lovely photo. We showed them how they make it, didn't we, the other day? Yeah, but we didn't tell them we were going to do that. It was a surprise. And along we go. Okay, so there's our two little hearts. So, next little bit then. I'm going to focus on this one to start with. Let's turn it this way. What I want to do is I'm going to create a curve, sort of here to here, like that. Okay. And then down here, same one. That way. Okay. Let's do the same on this one. All along there. And another one there. Okay. So then. I'm going to put like a little C there. You see those little gaps? Let's fill them in. And then I'm going to do the same here while I'm on this side. Like little gaps. And same in this one. And same on this one. And just sort of Fill those bits of ink in there. Okay. Oh, I hope she feels better soon, Jules. Send her my love. A little aura around those shapes there. And around. Turn it around. And around that one. So we've got that going. Okay. So we'll turn to this sort of direction again. Let's just sort of move out a bit. Oh. So following this line, I'm going to come along and then it's going to go underneath that shape and then out here. Same with this one, around. And out there. And the same this way. And then the same here, around and out. Like little buttons, aren't they? Around and out. Same on this one. And then this one, along. In we go. And in we go. Okay, so far so good. And again, you see that they're slightly different, but that's absolutely fine. I'm not worried about that at all. So, oh, okay, let's go a little bit bigger now. And if you can, obviously making sure that your, uh, your ink's dry before you rub anything out. I'm just going to get rid of those little marks around the, uh, the heart shapes there. Now, if you didn't want to do the heart shapes, you could actually have done an oval there, or you could have done um, a triangle, or even a square if you wanted to. So don't think um, you've got to do the hearts. Not a problem at all. It's fine. 
Yeah, we've, we've decided, Leslie, if there's anything wrong with those bags, we're going to blame you. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, and Which bags? Those bags you're doing there right now. Oh. Those making tapes, yeah. It's always my fault. I know, yeah, but Chris around. said as well, Chris said it'd be your fault. I've got brought... Thanks, Chris. <laughs> Talk about throwing your friends under the bus. <laughs> oh, Sue, so the, the tile swap deadline is Monday. We, uh, we did it and left it longer because we knew that we'd got the NEC and so we wanted to... And shows. And shows and things, and we wanted to make sure that um, we've got time to actually go through them and, and do it properly. Okay, so I've done a wavy line and I'm adding a little bit of thickness just to that line there, just sort of a little bit randomly. And then I'm gonna do another line and follow the shape that I've created like that. So I can add another couple of little bobbly bits in that line. But what I'm gonna do here before I go into the next row, I'm gonna put, um, a little loop in, a little line on it, and then I'm going to do a little loop that way, a little line in, and then I'm going to carry on and create another line, and let's put in a couple of those little bubbles again, and then follow the line and the shape along there, and every time I put these little wobbly bits in. I'm trying not to follow the pattern that was there before. I'm trying to look for sort of spaces that I've perhaps not got one in before. Okay. Let's see, I put one there, look. Put one there. And I think this time I'm going to put a little loop in there. And a little loop in there. And follow it down. Seeing Add some more of these. I see that one's going to go up and behind there, so that's absolutely fine. Follow it through, see? Again, little bumps and things. And let's follow that line again. See little bumps in where we can. I'm going to put another one in. Bumps. You see how it's starting to form this sort of a pattern here? So I'm going to put a couple of little loops in there. Quite a narrow one. Okay. And then in and around we go. Same as before, following that line. So I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Now you can work your way over and do it this way, but I'm going to find it a bit easier, I think, to turn it round. What I've got to remember is my loops are now facing this way. So I want to make sure that uh, I don't forget that. So here we go, back in with those little loops. Does it sound like somebody's eating sweets in the cinema, doesn't it, in the background? I do apologize, everybody. Sorry, kids. <laughs> Leslie. <laughs> there we go. We don't mind her really. You know you all love me really. We do. What a good day. <laughs> oh, no. That was mean. <laughs> well, she's packed up Dobby's clothes anyway. Yeah. Do you want a cup of tea? I do, yeah. Yeah. I mean, Dobby's been a diva this morning, hasn't he? Yeah, he yeah. has. He wants, to, he wants his own suitcase packed this time. I know, but he didn't want to pack it himself. He's asked Leslie, uh, Leslie to pack it for him. So we've tried to sort of get him to do it. And said, Look, you know, somebody might stop you and say, have you packed your suitcase? But who knows? Who knows? I mean, to be honest, if he sees Pauline Wheeler, I'll not see him all weekend anyway. Okay, I'm gonna put a loop in or else. There you go. Loop on that way. Okay. And in we go. Adding those little lines just as before. <laughs> I know Jules. <laughs> Dobby can be like that sometimes. He's a bit of a diva. Now he goes on the tally. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's have a little look at that. Okay, so you see we've got these lovely little loops working their way around. So let's uh, let's have a look at this one. 
I'm going to do a similar sort of thing and uh, I should be able to pick up the pace a little bit now because I think you've all got the hang of it. So let's have some little uh, bobbles and things going on and uh, filling them out. Let's put little loops in. I think once you've, you've got the hang with a particular tile, I think it does speed up anyway. And of course this one is, is quite random and you don't need to worry. I'm going to put another one out about having uh, wobbly lines or anything here because of course it uh, sort of uh, works well. Wobblier the line. Is that a word? Wobblier the better. <laughs> All right, let's put that little there. Put a bubble there. You can put them both sides if you want. You don't have to do them on one. Turn it round and I'm going to put a couple more lines in there and again let's add some of that thickness to those lines and along we go so put a couple of little loops there and some bubbles this actually would look really nice in different colours do you think as well we could do all the bits with it In these in. You can go as few or as many as you like of those. So whatever, whatever works for you. So we keep it going. There we go. Right, some extra bits in. And there. So I've left a bit of a gap there. It's, I don't mind. It's fine. So I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to draw the border in with um, a pen so I want to keep that. Now what you can do if you want, and we could continue it off, is you could continue this off and onto a page if you want to and then uh, you could or you could have it stopping here and coming out and under there and sound whales, whales sounds nice. We've, um, we've obviously we've got pending Stoke-on-Trent and Scotland for this year but absolutely I know Cornwall's been mentioned and uh, what, Wales as well yeah that'd be lovely but Dobby would want to come to Wales okay oh Bonnie is it still snowing there I must admit John says it's been snowing as well um he's he's took our dogs to the dog sitter so he says it's been snowing on the, on the M1. Right, you ready for this? Essex, you know, I've never been to Essex. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some random lines in. I know that word scares you. We don't want to go sort of too small. Let's put one along here. See, I'm going underneath each time. So that one wants to go that way. Bring this one along and around here. Tea or chocolate, madam? Oh, decisions. What's Dobby having? Well, he hasn't decided. He's waiting to see what you have. Oh. Then he can share yours and have his own. Oh. I'll have drinking chocolate, then. Any particular favour, madam? <laughs> <laughs> no, just as it comes. <laughs> Leslie very fine, kindly found me some... Um, <laughs> vegan hot chocolate so it, I can have a change from my green tea yeah, different flavours and everything <laughs> okay. so yeah I had to take a mortgage out to buy it guys oh I know it's, it's so expensive isn't it let's put one in there look okay, okay. 
I know, Viv, she is good to me. Yeah. I try. <laughs> I'm good to her too. <laughs> I will admit there that. There you are, see, there you are, see, there she's you are. She's a slave driver, but she's good too. I know, yeah, we all work as hard as each other here, we really do. Okay, so looking at my spaces here, now you can find the centre, you can do this in pencil if you're comfortable with it, it's not a problem. Oh, I think actually before I do that, I'm going to put some bubbles in. I was getting carried away then with that next angle. So, bubbles around the heart shape or the oval, or the square, or whatever shape you've done. But I'm gonna go underneath that ribbon, okay? Oh, so Florida would be awesome, absolutely. I would 100% love to go to Florida and do a few classes. So if anybody's up for helping me sort that out, we could make that happen. What do you think, Leslie, a trip to Florida? No. Leslie doesn't like to fly. You'd have to knock me out like they do for the Abrakus. See, now she's showing her age. <laughs> I'm going to have that hot chocolate all over me in a minute. <laughs> if you could teleport me there, I'd love to. Uh, I love flying. I love the flying part. For me, that's just, that's part of the holiday. <laughs> oh, Kathy, yes. Yes. Absolutely, I'd love it. I have actually been speaking with Hobby Maker about America and parcels and things. But I'm honest, I'm working on them, I'm working on them. We do okay so far, but Charlotte, I reckon we do, don't we? Yeah, shall we all go? We could have uh, a couple of days at Disney, couldn't we? And we could have a couple of days tangling. Yeah. Disney Springs to do a bit of shopping. Yeah, you go to Florida, I'd get holiday for two weeks. No, you just love to come in. No. Yeah. No, if yes. you're if you're sending it up, I'm I'm gonna two weeks off. Oh, gosh. Do you see, you can't get the staff, can you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I do. I love flying. <laughs> do you, Kathy? Oh, I absolutely love Disney. Love it. Okay, so where were we? We were on these sections here. Oh, here we are. We're getting all excited, look. Mentioning Disney, Florida, and a hot chocolate. Okay, so looking at my spaces, sort of imagine the middle-ish. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to come around and I'm going to create sort of like little loop shapes, but they're like little triangles. <laughs> and I'm going to follow the shape all the way around and I'm going to put in these sort of loopy triangle shapes where are you Chris? oh that's lovely we should have gone last year back in was it last year? November was it last year or the year before? I can't remember it could have been the year before actually you know when the, the borders were still locked and you couldn't get in and they opened it sort of about a week or 10 days after our holiday, so it got cancelled. And they could have rebooked the flights, but we we book our holidays around our dogs. So um, we couldn't get the boys in at their dog sitter. So we didn't go. Mm -hmm. We will, we'll go back. We'll go back. Okay, so you can see what I'm doing now. I'm actually taking each section and following the shape and filling it in with these sort of triangular, loopy kind of shapes. Now, this would be something quite nice to do as well with a different colour or maybe a, a grey rather than the black because it is more in the background. Let's see. Now, some of these gaps, you can fill them in if you like, or you can leave them so they're sort of visible. Whatever you want to do with them. I'm going to sort of do them as I go. And as it completely depends on the, the finished look you want, this is going to be a little bit more dramatic. And it just sort of gives it that bit of an edge. 
quick sip of hot chocolate before Leslie. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a Maltese's hot chocolate. Right. In case I realise, I'm not a vegan. It's just that there's no dairy in them, so I can drink it. You get sick of drinking tea all the time. I'll make a change. See, this one here, I'm going to sort of, I can fill it in. Or I can sort of put a loop in as though it's going underneath, like such. Depends what you want to do there. Okay. Oh, Jules, okay, we'll see you soon. It won't be long. Have fun. All right. You see, just working my way around. Each of these little shapes, I'm going to get two in there. Oh, Glennis, I keep trying to tell her that. I keep, especially how she drives. <laughs> so she's not here to listen now. But she'll watch this back later and then she'll slap me tomorrow. <laughs> there we are. Just uh, filling those little... You see how you get like a different shape thing, don't you, when you do it this way? Because we've done like the rhyme, random lines. Oh, Sue, <laughs> that would be a little bit much. I must admit, actually, we've, we've recently had our downstairs decorated and I have actually taken down my Disney paintings because the whole downstairs and the hallway were actually, it was like a gallery of Disney. So, so were they going to go up in the loft because I painted them? And now uh, we're going to swap things. I thought actually I'm going to use the feather stencil and I'm going to do some large feather designs um, in my living room and then I'm using my my, my round my circle frames and I'm going to do a, a large mandala type of design in the kitchen. Now you've got to be, just be a bit careful here remember that you've got a sort of a ribbon running through so you don't want to be drawing these shapes in your ribbon. So if you need to just sort of mark it or put a ticker across in it or something, just so you uh, if you don't forget. So there you go, see? Got to make sure that we've got that and we're not going to draw these shapes in there. We need that to stand out. Okay. So... See how that's sort of working? Shall we have a look at it? See where it's at at the minute? Yeah, look at that. Look at all these different shapes going on. So here, I'm going to imagine that it's going underneath because I don't want to fill it all with ink. Put those in there. Oh, Wendy, that sounds cool. That's a motorbike drawing. I think sometimes it's nice to have a change now and again, isn't it? I mean, my Disney ones have been up quite a while. So it's nice to have a change. There's a little one there. And then here, see, I've got this one. This, how am I going to do that? Do you know what? I could do that. So if you've got a piece and you think, oh, I don't even know how I'd do that shape. It's not a problem. Um, you can just sort of mark it out. And just uh, change the shape of it to suit what you need it to be. There you go. See, some of them are going to be bigger and smaller than others. So, you've just got to go with whatever shape you've got. Oh, do you think so, John? Would you like to? I can, uh, I can sort that. They're not in the loft yet. I'll, uh, I'll take some photos. Might have to uh, blow the dust off them. <laughs> well, that sometimes happens. Why don't you forget to dust across the top? Yeah. Okay, so this one here is going to be... Uh, again, I can do a full one, or I can sort of pretend that the middle's around here somewhere and work it round that way. So, uh, same with this one. So maybe uh, it's there, look. 
I sort of imagine that it's going underneath. Oh, at least I'll do that then. Same Leslie, I've got loads of Disney pictures, haven't I? Oh yeah, they're lovely. I've uh, took them all down. They are really nice, really good. I don't know. I mean, I like them all. I, I like don't... the... Oh... Snow White Wicked Queen. Oh, Maleficent. Maleficent, yeah. She sat, She actually stood at the top of my stairs. <laughs> and she's got um, like acrylic gems and things on. Yeah, I like her. So, uh, she sparkled when the light went on. She was watching over you. She was, yes. And Benji when he ran up and down the stairs. That's just why Seth never liked going up the stairs. Maybe so. <laughs> Maybe he thought, I'm not going up there. She'll get me. Oh, Maleficent was, you know, misunderstood. Yes, she was, very much so. It's one of my favourite Disney films, I yeah. think. shapes and filling in the uh, little bit of ink as we go and then next on the list so again you could actually do this in different colors that look quite nice I know on the hobby maker show the other week I was I did some background with different colored pens I certainly on the, uh, the bird in flight and I did the butterflies in a different colour in the background. Yeah, or so Bambi. I think of Bambi actually sometimes driving into work, or certainly when John drives, because we see a lot of deer in the fields. And certainly with it being quite bad weather, certainly on Friday it was terrible driving up here. Needless to say, uh, one, I didn't see any because I was busy driving. And two, they probably would have been uh, well tucked away somewhere in the trying to keep warm. That's where my stag stencil came from because uh, I, sketch I did a few sketches based on what I saw there. Oh, Glennis, that would be nice. It means you won't see him as much maybe, but... See here, look, I'm just sort of imagining that it's going underneath. I'm not going to worry too much about trying to keep a, a design going as such because it's all in the background. Okay. See how that just sort of works its way round? And there. Again, just sort of fill in little bits. Same with this one, so I'm, I'm going to do the whole sort of shape. It's going to get a bit wider, but that doesn't matter. There we go, still a little bit different there. Okay. All right. And then let's do this one. Oh, thank you, Claire. Well, I do try and do different ones, so People, we've all got different tastes. At least something will appeal to everybody at some point. And of course, it's three years, three years next week since I did the first tile. There we go. Three years, we've done three years worth of tiles. Goodness me. Okay, so I'm gonna bring my pencil in now. And uh, to oh, yeah, I've got a torty on there, it's all ready to go. Okay, here we go. So first things first. Now, if you want to actually use colour pencils for this, not that I'm saying you have to, or you could use any, you don't have to use mine. But you might want to do the ribbon in a colour or you might want to do the, the around the heart shape in a bit of colour. So whatever, whatever we want to do. But I'm going to just stick with my pencil and let's do this first. So pencil on either side and then in the middle as well. Now I could come back in with pencil over the top if I wanted to. You know, coloured pencils and that would give me a slightly more muted colour. But um, I'm just going to go with this for now. Let's have a look at it. 
this. I do have one that I've done a bit of colour on, so you, you know, unless you'll be able to see the difference between the two, then you can make up your own mind as to what you want to do. Okay, so see, both sides like so. Oh, Bonnie, thank you. Do you know, it's helped me too. It's, you know, it's, it's helped my sanity as well as yours. So I think it was a little bit, uh, we've all gained from it. We've all, you know, helped each other. I do honestly see that. And we are a team, you know. If you weren't as supportive as you are, then I wouldn't be doing this, would I? So, okay, I'm going to just round the uh, shapes there. I'm going to add just a little bit to the inside of that heart. Now this depends on how wide your line is there. I don't want it to be too much. If you think it's a bit narrow, then perhaps just go back in with the pen. I could just get a little bit in there. But again, look at your tile and you see how you feel with it. So looking at these shapes, I'm not going to do every single individual one. I mean, you can, but the main thing is this here. This is background. So, of course, if you've got uh, pastel pencils, which I know a few of you have, you could add some colour here by doing this with your pastel pencils. But I'm going to stick with my regular pencil and I've just gone around the outside of the shape. Okay, let's just have a look at that. There you are. So I'm going to do the same with all of them. Now, if you wanted to go around each individual one, you could, that would look quite nice. It's no sleeting. Oh. Here. Oh, nice. But, uh, I'm just going to go around the whole lot of the shapes there. And uh, add some pencil in. Same in this one. one so that's all of them done okay totty on there we come with that Let's see if i could find one here we go there's always a few around somewhere i've got a load here if you want one i'm all right thank you got one okay so let's come in and starting here i'm just gonna i want to make sure that that's solid there but then let's just push it out and in towards the center and then same on this side, push it out. Now I don't want them to touch, I want to leave a little gap in the middle so I can put a bit of highlight in. And the same with this one, you see, just sort of push it out a bit. And this side. Oh, thank you, Elizabeth. Catch up, you don't have, there's no rush, you can go back to them whenever. Just do, do you know, do the ones that you can. So then into this one, same sort of thing, soften it all off and then pull it out. Same with this one. Okay. And then into this one. See, it's just sort of giving it a little bit of movement there. That's all we need. Sort of pull it out, keeping that solid at the back there, and then just helping it to work it right in. Oh, Heather, that's nice. It was it's one of those things that did really grow in lockdown. And we all helped each other through quite a lot. We really did. But you've found us now, so you can actually. If you go back and watch the other videos, you'll actually sort of see how it grew. You know, and some of the conversations that we had and things that were going on at the time. So, but uh, that would be nice. You, you know, you're able to sort of see that. And then, of course, as the books came out, the about this book at the front of each each session, um, it sort of explains where we were. So it's a little bit of history in the making there. Uh, 
Okay, you see what I'm doing now? I'm just sort of the, creating this sort of shadow around the uh, outside of these shapes here. So I'm not putting too much effort into these as such because they are the background. So we don't want to give it too much attention because we want the main thing to be that ribbon. where we're at so far. I'm just going to now bring in my white chalk pencil, which is uh, this one here. And of course on the, the highlights here, I'm going to add a little bit of white just on the top there where that light had hit. And then just a little bit in between there. And then same on this side little bit and around into that one. Okay, I'll tell you what I haven't done. I didn't actually do a little bit of softening around the heart shape. I've got to make Tommy a drink and get him told off. Oh, how could you? Tommy's in there working away. Leslie didn't make him a drink. Intention to ask him, and then you know what it's like. Oh, oh gosh, Brenda, you've been you've been suffering with me for a long time. Then, <laughs> thank you so much for staying with me. It means a lot, really does. I'm just saying, Leslie, Brenda's been with us since the first. That's amazing. I know, and, and Pat Craven was as well, wasn't she? And yeah. a few others. Yeah. There's a, didn't we say the other day? Actually, there was about fifty of us. To sort of, 30, 40, 50, like that. To, to start with, I mean, I only thought I was going to get like eight or 12 people, maybe. And it went up to 50. And then it went up to a few more. And we've just hit 5,000 on the page. How did that happen? Okay. Well, oh. We do not know. And I just apologise for Tommy. I'm, I'm making a mess. Yeah, here we are having a nice, quiet, relaxing, calming tangle. Tommy's making a, toes, making, a, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> making a mess in the background. All right, I'm just going to soften off that a little bit. I don't want it to be too sort of bright. Oh, do you know, it's lovely and we're such, such a lovely group. I know we all have our ups and downs now and again, but we work through them. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to come back in with my black. <laughs> I'm just going to come back in like and draw in that ribbon again. There we are. Oh gosh, you know it's lovely, isn't it? And there's a story to tell with every single tile. There's some funny ones. There are some funny ones. There are some. Really yeah, things. more melancholy because you know we did one for uh, Susan and she passed. And then of course we did the jubilee and then we did the funeral. The Christmas we've done a lot. And remember we really pushed to get tile a hundred out on New Year's Eve, and that was something. Yeah, Lorraine, we always end up talking about food. Okay, I'm going to bring a little bit of colour in on this one. Cake. Yeah, it's usually the cake or, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, Janet, yes, how can we forget Ukraine? Uh, yeah, that we, we did a tile for those as well. Okay. Now, when you, you're adding colour in, it, it's a lot more muted when you've got your grey underneath and you don't really have to blend so much it's just about giving it that little bit of color little hint you see <laughs> oh. yeah so uh, it's, it's certainly been a, a journey hasn't it i have got a plan for next week i have because of course friday's tile I am going to have to cancel and I don't do that lightly.
because tiles don't stop for anything. But I can't honestly guarantee uh, Wi-Fi in the afternoon, of course, but um, in the evening at the hotel as well. So I, I don't want to sort of say I'm doing a tile, then find I have to swap and change. But um, I will make it up to you next week. That's all I'm saying for now. So there won't be a tile on Friday. Um, but I say I will make it up to you next week. Okay, I'm just going to bring my uh, lighter blue in there. Just want to... <laughs> oh, Rihanna, look at you now. We talk about you and your samples on the TV. In that little bit of colour. I'm not pressing on. I'm not there trying to some blend. Some of the amazing friendships that have been made. I know there's a lot of uh, people out there that weren't friends or didn't know each other, and now they do. And of course, they come to class and meet each other. Oh, Janet, thank you. I, I say I don't like to miss tiles, but um, I, I just don't want to. I, I, there's too many variables. I'm just using my dark blue. Oh, and one's going a bit. And I don't want to mess you about. So if we just say, let's just take Friday and not have a tie. I'm just going around that heart shape. Okay. Just with that dark blue. And I think I'm going to just bring in a little bit of pink as well. I wasn't going to put colour on this one, but it just feels like it. Just a little bit of uh, pale pink. Just on those little loops there. Just sort of little hits. And again, I'm not pressing on. I'm trying to fill it all in. Uh, and the same here. Have a little look at that. Oh, camera's wandered off. There we go. See, just that little hint of pink's made all the difference there, hasn't it? See, now this is in the background and our ribbon's definitely at the front. I think uh, just a touch of that dark blue again. Just sort of on the, uh, the edges of that ribbon. Just to help bring it in. There we go. Little bits. And let me put that one. Okay. So, last one then. Let's have a look. All we need to do is to put our little signature in. So, there we go. So, there's our tile for the day. So, I did actually, let's just pull out a bit. I'd say I did actually do one. Uh, last I said last night and I've it's a slightly different heart shape here we go so it's a little bit wider but I've actually I've inked I've, what I've actually done is I, I drew it as before then I uh, shaded it then I've used spray and shine over the top you see and then I've actually gone back in and I've added some ink and I've added some orange to the ribbon as well so a couple of variations there whatever works for you or change it about change the shape uh, whatever you want to do really but they're like they are like little buttons aren't they i love it so this is the last one of this week uh, so just a little recap if you've got a badge if you've got a santangle badge and you've got it on and you come into the show this weekend then you will get 10 percent off anything on the uh, shop so it it's well worth wearing it you can't tell me you've got one at home <laughs> you've got to actually be wearing it so that'd be lovely if you can and of course there's not going to be a tile on friday but i will put an announcement out a little bit later and i'll make it up to you next week because i've got a bit of a plan so okay uh, if i don't see you at the nec um i will see you here back again on tuesday next week so until then have fun have a great time enjoy catch up on some of the tiles you might not have done so far and or even you know meet up and, and catch up together do a, a an online facebook live together if you want to whatever you want to do so i hope you've enjoyed it and i will see you all next week okay take care everybody